Hi Scorpio, this is Shah. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're well and I hope last week's reading resonated uh, with you and had success. And I'm using some of the new cards and my favorites this week. And this is the Gorgon Tarot and I love it. Right, I'm going to take this card. What is it? The Moon. Okay, you might be highly sensitive as we are in Pisces and that is water element like yourself. There could be a prominent Pisces around you. So um, you could be meeting up with a Pisces. You uh, could be uh, meeting up whether you, they are in your life now or they could be the new a new person, a new friend that you're meeting. They could also be a mediator or a uh, medium, sorry, or a psychic or an empathic, somebody that works with nature as well as they are highly sensitive. Wow, that is really beautiful and it's been coming out that the energy is changing, it's more sensitive um, it's like also meditation cards, taking time out, the Four of Swords, the, the, the Hermit, um, they come out, meditation, everybody is rethinking on what is the next step, because if there is a new beginning and there will be a new norm, okay, there might be things that you don't know, because the Moon also has a dark side. Uh, you are in the spotlight. When you're in the spotlight, there's also illumination. You are being seen. Perhaps a Pisces has an eye on you. Wow. Listen to your to intuition at all time. That is your inner biorhythm warning system. So listen to your intuition. If something uh, sounds too good to be true, it usually isn't. Okay, that is your overall energy. But I think you feel will feel like a fish in water. And you've got the King of Cups. Wow. The King of Cups can be a Cancer. But I always say, just in case, it can be Scorpio. Yeah, it can be Pisces. And like I said, you're like a fish in water. And boom, the King is coming out. You've got your emotions under control. You are a very sensitive and loving person and uh, you are nurturing, passionate, loving, uh, also most probably very handsome and sensual and sexy. Ooh. And um, you have reached the status of the king. You've got everything under control. Anyway, that's what it feels like. Awesome. Especially in this uh, time, it, you might be extra sensual or sexy or sensitive. You've also got the star. There is a wish coming true for you. You might be romantically lying uh, along in the fields in high grass, although it's cold and wet uh, in, um, in the northern hemisphere, but if you're in Australia or New Zealand, it's warm and dry, you might be lying there with your Cancer Pisces or other Scorpio wishing upon the star, reaching for the stars together is fun. Okay, the star represents Aquarius, so there could be an Aquarius around you. Awesome. Here you are, you've got the Eight of Pentacles, recognition. A recognition means, uh, could be a recognition from your partner or somebody in the family or from your boss. This could also mean um, you might get a promotion, uh, a wage rise, um, uh, a promotion to a different position. So that is also a, a wage increase. Okay, you might want to leave a legacy behind for the next generation. Also, you might be starting a new study. Okay, now let's have a look at this one. You've also got the Page of Pentacles. There is news about money. Like I said, a job, something that is tangible, durable, and long-term. 
it could be news about a child it can be news about a job like I said something that is for long term okay it could be uh, Capricorn you could get news from a Capricorn because the page is Capricorn um, but don't forget Taurus or Virgo okay let's have a look and you have the four of cups you might be happy and feeling free and together but you are also it looks like you're overthinking things you might be depressed because you're not seeing what's happening around you you are totally shut off so come on come out of your head don't get depressed come in action do that research to what you need to know okay your wish can come true but it can't come true by itself you have to come into action and seek seek that information okay look what's happening around you not just in front of you you have your emotions under control you can do it you can reach the status of the king if you don't feel like you're the king okay then you've got the two of pentacles balancing home and work balancing in between in your relationship financially um, the balance will come in but you must come into action okay this news could be about a promotion like I said because you've got the recognition so you will be able to balance the finances again okay now let's see what we have here this one is sticking out times have been hard for you you've come a long way you've come a long way wow and you've got number 10 where there is an ending there is a new beginning okay start I'm um, hearing start delegating start delegating don't take other people's problems on that you've got enough to deal with yourself new beginning and you've got temperance again balance temperance does um, represent uh, Sagittarius perhaps you've been trying to balance since December your finances perhaps December was uh, an expensive month for you come on get out there um, be seen nothing is going to change if you're not out there and taking action now I'm going to take also a Lenamon card uh, a Lenamon card I love these Lenamon that's my golden Lenamon okay and there's the angel if you're signing contracts be careful there is a snake in the grass okay something is slithery something might not be, uh, if it sounds too good to be true then it won't most probably isn't be aware of the snake you've got seven so that means good luck now you've got uh, the moon here 23 22 uh, 17 I mean 17 to 18 okay you are moving up though because you've got 17 here and 18 there also with the snake the snake changes his skin every six months so you are changing only if you're open and you get out of your head there is a new beginning find your balance uh, it's an attitude game you've got the recognition so you are strong and you are being seen don't give up this new beginning is there your wish is coming true the w if a wish comes true then that is also um, a, um, a mind um, a new beginning um, you've also got the Queen of Wands you've got the Queen of Wands the Queen of Clubs so take a page out of her book it could be an Aries uh, Leo she's usually Leo but don't forget Aries or Sagittarius that could be prominent women around you or woman and you could be meeting up with them or a new one you could already be hooked up and you might be sharing your dreams with her awesome 
you have the pink angel feather you saw me shaking the cards love is in the air the romance angels are here to inform you that there is an interesting development about to take place in your love life so yes this is a general reading take it from what 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 you can if your wish is to get uh, together with a, a water sign a fire sign uh, an earth sign then uh, you have to balance yourself you've got two cards talking about balance and definitely balance your money could also be a, pi a water sign here you are Pisces Cancer but don't forget Scorpio don't forget yourself either okay you know how the water signs are that will st stand you in good stead that will help you but do your research the dark side of the moon do re do research find out what you can do what you want what they want that is sharing you've also got two people here in this deck so if you see the figure two 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 then um, it is the angels showing you a sign I'm not looking at the number of the star I'm looking at these two people you've got two people here two people there so it's about being together that is what I'm and the angels are saying take um, something will interesting developing or interesting development about to take place in your love life I think you might be coming together or if you have had an argument you will forgive each other don't worry don't take on other people's problems sometimes you can't help others you have to help yourself first before you can help anybody else people have to learn from their own mistakes you know that just let them know that you are there but you can't solve their issues your wish is coming true just keep your emotions under control don't fly off the handle don't be uh, try to get to your higher self sit quietly go sailing uh, and ponder Ah, I had a boat and it's lovely in the moonlight the warmer weather is coming along so perhaps you might be taking uh, uh, one of these people on your boat if you've got a boat otherwise it's like get out into nature because we've got a lot of nature cards these are nature cards and this okay I hope you've enjoyed this reading and be careful of the snake in the grass but you do have seven luck 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 you have your wishes I'm, I'm going to burn a candle for you I'm sure your wish is going to come true take care and believe in yourself you're stronger and better than you think. Ciao, ciao.